man, if there was just one specific place we could go to to find a large gathering of the most attractive men on the planet. Hmm. Okay, I know what you guys are thinking. Yeah, right, lady. That place only exists in our dreams, blah, blah, blah. But FYI, this place actually does exist, IRL. And no, I am not talking about Tinder, although there are some hotties on Tinder. Uh, but yes, I am talking about the CW Network. Yep, you heard me right. Many of the network's most popular shows, like The Vampire Diaries, Arrow, Jane the Virgin, Supernatural, and so many more are just overflowing with total hunks with the best sexy smirks, chiseled jawlines, and bulging muscles. Stop it right now, our hearts cannot handle all of this. So as much as we would like to add every guy on the network to our list, we just don't have enough room and I don't think there's enough time on the clock. So we're just gonna run down the top 13 hotties on the CW. Are you ready? All right, coming in at number 13 on the hot list, we have Mr. Torrance Coombs, who is featured on the CW's reign as Sebastian. Maybe it's because he's Canadian, or maybe it's because of his facial scruff, or maybe it's because his eyes could literally light up my life because they are so bright, I don't know. But he definitely had to make the cut, no doubt. Making his way at number 12 on our list is the funny guy, Misha Collins, who you might see as Castiel on the CW's hit show, Supernatural. Misha is known for his laugh out loud sense of humor on and off screen, which instantly makes any guy like 500 times hotter, in my opinion. He isn't in heaven, he has to be somewhere. Try New Mexico, I hear he's on a tortilla. No, he's not on any flatbread. And at number 11 on our list is the ultra sexy Joseph Morgan who plays Klaus Michelson on the originals. Okay, so it's no question that he made this list first and foremost because of his incredible British accent, but he has got this super classic vibe going on and if I didn't know better, I would literally think he's from a different era. I'm Gatsby. For number 10 on our list, we took this one from the CW's Jane the Virgin. Yeah, I mean, sure, this guy is a looker, but man, oh man, is Justin Baldoni a totally swoon-worthy romantic straight out of a cheesy romance comedy, and you know I love me some cheese. So not only is he a doll on camera, but in real life, he planned the most incredible real life wedding proposal video to his now wife, Emily, complete with boy bands, a flash mob, a Porsche, and he even flew her mom in from Sweden, I have goosebumps, and went to her dad's memorial to ask for his daughter's hand in marriage. Where are the tissues? Safe to say he's pretty okay in our book. Will you let me take care of you for the rest of your life? Will you let me be your husband? All right, we're only just getting warmed up here, seeing that these guys are only getting hotter as we progress. Coming in at number nine, we have Heart of Dixie's country boy, Wilson Bethel. Now, what is a list of hot men without a little southern charm? Am I right, y'all? Wilson's got those hard working muscles going on, and boy, I gotta say, he looks pretty good in flannel, too. And at number eight, we have Mr. Jared Padalecki, who plays Sam Winchester on the CW Supernatural. So if you've never really been into the whole long hair thing for guys, you probably will be after we show you this video. <laughs> Next up, we have got Mr. Handsome himself, Charles Michael Davis, who stars as Marcel on the originals. Okay. So there are two reasons why he's made our list besides the obvious stuff. First, for some reason, that mustache that he's grown is surprisingly sexy. And it's only a proven fact that guys with clean stashes have patience, grooming skills, and are total men because they can grow facial hair. That's logical, right? But we also must add that Charles is the very first single man that has made our hot CW list. Yes, ladies, he 
is available. Hitting our hottie list at number six, we have Jensen Ackles, who plays Dean Winchester on The CW Supernatural. So we tried with all of our might to come up with specifically one feature that we love about him, but have you seen his eyes and his smile and his hair and just like every other feature? Yeah, and his resume is pretty impressive. I mean, soap opera star turned ghost hunter? Sign me up. Now, you guys, try to contain yourselves for our next CW hottie, because at number five, we have my favorite smoldering face, Colton Haynes from the hit series Arrow. Ah, uh, yes, I just will start by pointing out the obvious. His jawline resembles that of a Greek god. It might even be better, and is sculpted so profoundly that it could quite possibly cut through glass. Get it, Colton. On to number four, you guys, we're getting pretty close to the top of this list. We have the blood-sucking Stefan Salvatore, aka Paul Wesley from The Vampire Diaries. Now, be careful, because if you stare too deep into his eyes for too long, you could get sucked into a swooning vortex of pure lust and never return, which probably isn't a bad thing, because it's Paul Wesley. All right, enough of this cheesiness or has it been enough? Coming in at number three on our list, and by the way, if you haven't recognized him since he's literally the fastest man alive, he plays Barry Allen, AKA The Flash. So yeah, Grant Gustin obviously looks wonderful in a suit, but take a look at what else he can do. I met a girl crazy for me. I met a boy cute as can be. The summer day is drifting away. You're fast and you can sing? <laughs> what can't you do? I mean, yeah, we're kind of asking ourselves that too, if only we could just find someone like that in real life. Anyway, our hot men of the CW would not be at all complete without one of the most well-known actors slash vampires of all time. Yes, of course, you know we are talking about Ian Somerhalder. So although the hunky actor is newly engaged to Nikki Reed, which we should add they both played vampires, see, perfect couple, there is just no way we can't stare at that million dollar smolder that he has got going on. I mean, try it, there's just no way you can't stare. And the moment that you have all been waiting for, even though we're sure you already know who's the number one hottest guy to ever reside on the CW, a little preview, shall we? Oh my gosh, oh yes, it is Stephen Amell. We are talking about you, sir, playing Oliver Queen on the CW's Arrow. It's really no question that the Amell family are the winners of some sort of genetic lottery, seeing as his cousin is the Duff star, Robbie Amell. But Stephen, hands down, takes the cake on this one because what part of him is not absolute perfection? Am I right, you guys? And it looks like that is all we have for our list of the CW's hottest actors, even though, I mean, let's be serious. We could go on and on about this topic, but you all let us know what you thought. And I do know that there are a ton more eligible men that could have made this list. So tell me who you think should also be mentioned. And you can do that by joining the convo down in the comment section. Then of course, click right over here to learn seven things even you might not know about Ian Somerhalder. Thanks so much for hanging out with me right here on Clever. I'm your host, Jocelyn Davis. Have a supernatural rest of your day.